Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. If you are new to my channel, do like and subscribe. Today's video, I am going to share some very frequently asked questions in PHP developer interview. So these questions are based on real experiences that I have faced in my career. Uh, so today I'm going to share all these questions one by one with you all so that if you are preparing for a PHP developer interview or if you are learning PHP and might go for an interview so that these questions can help you to crack your interview. So let's start. The very first question is what is the difference between include and require function? This is the most common question that interviewer can ask whether you are a fresher or an experienced developer. Okay, so next question is, what is the difference between is set and empty function? So you need to explain the difference between both of them. Next question is, what is the difference between array merge and array combined functions? As the name suggests that these two functions are used for array. So you need to explain that what is the major difference between both of them and how they work. Next question is, what are traits in PHP and why we use them? So you need to explain the concept of traits and uh, if you can give an example uh, with a scenario, so it will be great. Next question is, what is single inheritance and does PHP support single inheritance? Is there any, uh, uh, is there any additional uh, method to implement single inheritance in PHP? So these type of questions can be asked. So you need to answer that. Next question can be how to handle file uploading in PHP and all the exceptions that can be arised during the file upload process. So there can be multiple file upload, there can be single file upload. So what can be the exception that you need to handle in uh, file upload process? So you need to explain that. Next question can be what is abstract class and differentiate between abstract class and the interface. So you need to give an example and uh, explain the difference between both of them. Next question can be that how would you handle errors and exception in PHP? What are the different methods to handle error efficiently? So you need to explain them and uh, you can give an example as well. So that will, uh, that will give the interviewer more clarity that you are aware of it. Next question can be what is the use of final keyword? What is basically does mean? So you need to explain it. Next question can be what are the namespaces in PHP and uh, basically what it is and uh, what is the use of it. So you need to explain it precisely. Next question can be scenario based that uh, how would you optimize the performance of any PHP application if, if the web app is not performing well or is slow. So what will be the steps that you will take to improve its performance. So you need to think all the aspects of a web application and need to answer according to that. So next question can be, how would you secure your PHP applications from various security concerns? So you need to think about it and answer it uh, in, a, in, a, in a proper way so that it will create a good impact on the interviewer. Apart from this, uh, a question can be arised from the PSR standards. What, what are the PSR standards in PHP? What are the role they play uh, in PHP coding? So you need to explain it. So yes, these were the questions that I have been and that I have experienced in my uh, uh, career throughout. So uh, I, I, I just created a list and, uh, and I just decided to share with you all. I, uh, I, I just uh, think that th these questions will help you to uh, crack your interview on, as a PHP developer. So I'll do very best from my side for your next interview. See you in the next video. Till then, keep learning, keep growing.